welcome to News Extra. And if you're looking for something different to do on the first day of 2020, well, we have the ticket for you out at the Wildcat Hills Nature Center with a first day hike. One of many that are taking place across the state at various game and parks facilities. I have Amanda Filippi, education specialist for the center with me today. Thank you for joining us. Thanks for having me. Uh, let's talk a little bit about the, the hike itself. Give us some of the details. Yes, it starts at one o'clock on New Year's Day. Um, we're going to meet up at the Nature Center and then we're going to go down some of our trails. So we're asking folks to dry, or dress warmly. I was going to say, <laughs> with, with the weather we have going on right, right. now, you know, it's, it's a little cool outside at the moment. Yes. And it's not like those trails necessarily have been heavily trekked at this moment either. No, so it'll be, uh, I'll go out um, before the, the, the hike and see what's going on out there and we'll pick one of the trails that we'll go down. It won't be a very long hike, okay. probably be uh, less than a half a mile, somewhere in there. We're not okay. going to go on a, you know, four day backpacking adventure <laughs> or anything like that. But um, we're going to start there at the Nature Center. We'll go down one of our trails and then we'll meet back up at the center and have some cookies and hot chocolate. So Ooh, it should be like, exciting. Yeah, sounds, sounds like fun. Now what? Um, in previous hikes, what have people come across uh, during those hikes? Because there's still wildlife and, yes. and all kinds of things going on. We've seen lots of animal tracks. We've seen animal scat out there. So there's signs of wildlife out there. And if we're lucky, maybe we'll see some while we're out on the trails. Mm -hmm. And of course, the, the there are some of the trails that are you know, relatively steep, but we're not going to be probably going on those just because of the conditions. Right, right. So it'll wait until the day of. It's supposed to be pretty nice. Mm -hmm. Weather's supposed to, I don't want to jinx it, but it's supposed to be pretty nice. <laughs> Um, but we're just asking folks to be prepared for that weather and wear nice hiking shoes and, and jackets and everything like that. And of course, when you say nice, you mean nice for the first day of January right. <laughs> here, here in the, here in winter. Of course, uh, that's not the only thing that is going on with Game and Parks and out at the Wildcat Hills Nature Center. And we'll be back on News Extra in just a moment to tell you more about that. And we're back on News Extra and we're talking with Amanda Filippi, who's the Education Specialist at the Wildcat Hills Nature Center out for the Nebraska Game and Parks Commission. Again, thank you very much for joining us. Thank you. Of course, we've been talking about the first day hike, one of uh, many across the state taking yes. place here on the first day of the new year. Right. That's not the only thing that's going on though uh, with with Game and Parks. There are other things that are in process mm -hmm. and, and that includes at the Nature Center. Right, so. so we've got our monthly homeschool and preschool programs going on even during the winter time. Um, and folks are welcome to come out. We are open 8 to 4 every day to come out, um, hike, get your park permit, lots of fun stuff to do out there. And of course, the, there is the, um, the, uh, the range that's nearby now. Is that closed during the winter? It is. It'll open back up on the 24th of January. Okay, so we've so got a few more weeks, but it'll yeah. be back open. It'll be back open and, and ready to be used at that time. And of course, right now, definitely planning going ahead. Uh, for things later this winter and early spring, I would think. Yes, we're working on our 2020 schedule. Um, we've got a lot of great programs coming up and a lot of good guest presenters coming in and helping us um, celebrate this 2020 year. So. Yeah, that's going to be a whole lot of fun. Of course, the big thing, of course, is the first day hike yes. uh, in which you can get outdoors. Yes, I know it's the first day of January and it's not going to be, you know, 70 degrees outside necessarily. But, um, you know, dress warmly, dress yep. for the conditions, good, good shoes good yep, boots yep. and uh, be there for that first day hike yep and it's starting at one o'clock at the nature center so if folks need to come out and buy their park sticker for 2020 they're more than welcome to do that ahead of the the hike and um, we'll be excited to have them out there so hopefully by one o'clock it'll warm up and it'll be nice. and of course having that park sticker very important to be able to access a lot of the events mm -hmm. including many of them that are free right. such as the first yep. day hike uh, which are going to be coming up throughout 2020 and, and uh, something that's very easy to do. Yeah, but Amanda, thank you very much for joining us on News Extra today. Thank you.